Welcome back, my hatchlings, to Pokemon Fire Red. Random luck. I don't know why I walked into the Pokemon Center. As you just saw, Glen evolved, finally, and I guess it's worth noting it's been seven months since I've recorded the series. The two videos before this were recor recorded back in April. This one's in November. Yeah, it's been a while. But it's okay, most of it had to do with the rock tunnel. So. I actually came up with a solution for that, which I'm going to show right here. I apologize, I got interrupted and I hardly ever get interrupted, but anyways, I managed to acquire Flash and I'm going to teach it to our dead Gloom, and I know some people might be like, hey, that's cheating. Well, I don't want to teach it to one of my main Pokemon. I don't feel like catching a slave, and we already have her dead body as a HM slave that we've been using for cut, so why not? So I purposely made her faint before evolving Glenn, so that way she'd be fainted, so that way if we get roared out of battle because I'm pretty sure there's some Growl Growlithe in here that no roar. It doesn't switch over to her and counts it as cheating or anything. So, anyways, we're gonna keep Glenn up front and we're gonna head into Rock Tunnel. And I'm hoping this goes well. I really, really put off let's playing this game for seven months just because I really did not want to come here. But. I guess it's also worth noting that I got Flash off screen by catching a Vileplume and Venomoth. Just not to use, just to get my Pokemon count up to 10 so I could get Flash. So that's how. And here's my Cargo, which we caught here. And as one of our official team members, they are in the sidebar, but they're not with us right now. It's Maggie to my Cargo. And that's because we needed room, and I figured there's probably ground types in here, so and water types. I'm pretty sure there's slow books in here. And Cedar's the first ground type. But we should really ease through this place. I'm going to speed through, I think. Ouch. Earlier in the series, I said I wasn't going to speed up anymore. Well, seven months later, I feel like speeding up. And I've actually been watching a Leaf Green A Glock. That's why I kind of know what's in here, because where I am at in that series is right after Rock Tunnel. So I figured I should start Let's Play this and kind of catch up to that. Maybe play along that so I know. I don't really remember exactly what I have to do in this game, but. Uh, if I didn't mention it last time, I do have an X in my name now, because in order to enable the national decks to evolve any Johto and Hoenn Pokemon, apparently I had to change my name in the process. I don't know if that was actually a mess up on my part, but in case I didn't mention it, it does make my Pokemon gain more experience that I've caught already. So it's kind of, I guess in a way it's kind of cheating. I wasn't purposely cheating, it's accidental cheating. So I apologize, there's an Abra. I thought I was going to be like, you can't run away, and then it was going to teleport, because that happens. And I just remembered something. I actually bought some repels just for this cave. Only bought like 11 of them, I had one. And we just found one, okay, that's cool, that's very funny, I did not know that was a repel, honestly. So let's go down. Lots of rocks, cool. <coughs> This place is so frustrating when you're not using Flash. Like, it's it's so annoying. I hate that you need. I hate caves that require Flash. I hate them so much. Except I didn't. I don't. I don't really mind Duford Cave and Ruby Sapphire and Emerald because it's so easy just to go in there without Flash. I've done it so many times without Flash. I could. You do go through there without Flash. It's so easy. Here's a revive. We could sell that. And I wish this was 5th slash 6th gen, or and I see if you want a repel, or to put out another one. But, uh, I don't come here, but I'll battle you, alright. Why are you doing in a cave, Martha? That's an old lady's name. I actually don't like having Glenn out here. So we're gonna throw out Judith. I actually should probably train our Oscar, the swine nub. It'd be, this is actually a really good place to train him. But we're gonna let Judith handle the rest of this battle. Why not? 
And I guess another reminder, in case, since I haven't uploaded this long time, some of you may have forgotten, even though I probably uploaded two episodes before this, or all the ones I haven't uploaded those yet. I don't know if I'm making sense of my words. But this is a Walking Dead inspired name stuff. Hold on. I apologize. Okay, so, onward. I don't even remember what I was talking about, but... Let's continue training with... Should I, I think I should continue training with Oscar. That's what I was gonna do. Alright, sorry. I got taken away for a while, so I'm back now, a couple hours later. And let's continue our sweep of Rock Tunnel. I believe I left off talking about how much I hate this tunnel. You don't have a ground type move? How come you don't have a ground type move? Whatever, we'll use Powder Snow. I must be thinking of the swine up uh, slash Pilo Swine. Pilo Swine. Oh shit. Pilo Swine that I have in Soul Silver. That's probably why I thought you had like Mud Bomb or something. I at least thought you would have Mud Slap. I might have got rid of it because you're a physical attacker. And actually, all the physical and special stuff in third generation is all really kind of messed up compared to how it is in future generations, so that might still be wrong. I could have used Oscar right there, but I guess not. Dang it, Steve. Messing things up. So let's go ahead and heal. Do I have any regular potions? That's super. Super. Alright. Let's continue on. Uh, water. That's okay. Here we go. Hiker. That should be a good thing for Oscar to fight. You're gonna make me cry, really. Watch him kill one of our Pokemon, and I will be crying. What the G, dude? Hey, G, dude. I'm gonna Petter Snow you. Petter Snow. Oh, really? Barely. Where are you going down this next move then? Could have probably gone away with a tackle right there, but. Didn't want to risk getting hurt. I give, you're a better technician. Oh, because he was talking about techniques. It's funny. There's another one. Hit me with your best shot. Ba -da -ba -da. Fire away. Dem sideburns. Alright, match up. Alright, gonna have to switch right here for sure. Um, Judith, would you like to handle this one? Okay. I'm going to send a little tiny pig thing against a giant rock snake. And I believe the next gym is Celadon. So, because Lavender Town does not have a gym. Though we do have a rival battle there. But I don't think we could do anything else in that town until later on. I believe. I forgot. I don't know. I don't remember how exactly this entire area goes. I'm a little rusty in this game. Repels effect wore off. Might as well put another one up before I forget about it. Alright. This tunnel goes a long way, kid. It's not that long. Alright, this battle is made for Oscar. Oscar evolves on 32 or 34, one of those. Or maybe 30. Match up, switch out. Let's continue with Judith. We gotta train the little ones. But Maggie will be our main fighter in the cell dungeon. To switch back. I still know Oscar could like handle zone. I remember when I first caught him, ooh, there's a lot of close calls on him fainting when I was doing training. A lot of close call calls. I think the very first battle, like he got knocked down to like one or two HP. And then, same thing with my swine up in Soul Silver. It was a bitch to train. Except that one in Soul Silver is a female named Mastodon. Alright. Let's continue on. Hmm, maybe I'm lost in here. But I remember I was talking about different caves that require Flash. You know, I hate Rock Tunnel. Dark Cave is just okay, I guess. I don't know. I never really ventured too much in Dark Cave. In the Jodo region, but 
Duford Cave in Hoenn, super easy. Uh, something else that's kind of similar is Defog in the 4th Gen games. I did not like that route at all, because you don't have to use Defog to get rid of the fog, but if you fight in the fog, it lowers your accuracy a lot. It sucks. Onyx. Thunder Snow. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Oh, come on. And finish you off with another powder snow. Alright. And finish off with a Geodude. Hiker Oliver. Doesn't sound like a name for a hiker. Oliver is a cool name, though. Just does not fit a hiker. Oh, this guy doesn't even know where he's going. What a butt munch. Alright, um, let's see. Battle that guy. Did him not battle you. Outsider's like, why should I give you respect? You calling me an outsider? Are you saying you live here? Lucas? Alright, yeah, I'm getting a lot of training for Oscar. I believe the Celton Jin's highest Pokemon is 29, so we're actually a little over leveled slash on level. But let's finish off with the Scrabbler, and then I think I'll call it quits for Oscar for the day. I think I'll just cap him at 30. Oh, that did not do too much because we're part of ground type, of course. Nice. I give. Yeah, you better give me some respect. Alright, let's switch out. Let's put Lee up front. I'm gonna put Carl up here. Just put Oscar in the back. He's on break. Let's get some items in here. Escape rope. Isn't that the second one we found in here? Is there a way down? I know there's a move tutor in here. I think he teaches rock slide, and that's something I want. Which, actually, I want Rock Slide on Maggie. That would be good. Maybe. Is Maggie a physical or special attack? That's what it depends. I don't know. We'll we'll figure it out. Or actually, it might be good on Oscar, since Rock types are physical in this game, I believe. And then Swinums are physical Pokemon. Maybe. Um, let's go down here first. Nothing. Alright, fight you. Do you know how to avoid getting lost in the mountains? You can bend twigs and try all markers. I have a twig you could bend. Ha ha ha. Oh, it's a jiggly bone. Jiggly. Water though. Alright, let's bite it. If this was X and Y, bite wouldn't do that much because it's a dark type move and Jigglypuff's a fairy type Pokemon in that game. But we don't have to worry about that now. Tackle. Good, good. And a meow. Bite. And another bite. Om nom nom. Level 29, great. Oh, I did my best. Not at bending twigs. God damn it, Repel. They were, that was the only option. I couldn't buy Super Rebels. They didn't have them in stock. Mwahaha! <laughs> can you beat my power? Probably. Question is, can you beat mine? Probably not. How overleveled we are. I must have done some serious off screen training last time then. Because we're so overleveled. I think the main reason I did is because I really wanted, really wanted to get Oscar high level to where he could fight and not have to worry about him dying all the time. Almost level 30, so close. This next battle should do it up here. Oh, there's an item up there. You have a Pokedex? I want one too. Don't we all? Man, I have a few. Like, the toy Pokedex that they made, I have the third generation one. Actually, I might just only have that one. <laughs> Bite should be super effective. 
bite your tail off and sell it. Level 30, awesome. Another slowpoke. Alright, switch to Carl. He has bite too, I believe. Maybe not. Oh yeah, he does. Okay. Good job, Carl. You're our mascot. I'm the leader of the team. I think because of this Let's Play, I'm always going to forever name any future Magikarps and Gyarados as Carl. I just feel it's appropriate. Cool, cool. And let's go down here first. Nothing. Did I go down here? Oh, wait, no, I didn't. You're the move tutor. Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on. Alright, so, let's look at our team. Actually, I'm, I'm mostly just want to look at Oscar. Where's your stats? So, that would be my phone. Alright, attack. Yeah, yes, attack is the highest out of everything. When you evolve pretty soon, that'll be even good. So if you can learn Rock Slide, we'll we'll teach it to you. Yep, only once. I guess he has like an illegal TM. Yeah, and you're the only one that can learn it. Oscar wants to learn Rock Slide. If I once I get Maggie back and find out if she has higher attack than special attack, I might be a little bit upset. Just a little. Let's get rid of... I don't want to have takedown just because of this being a Nuzlocke and it doing HP back and Oscar having poor defenses. I think it'd just be bad to have takedown on him. And I don't see a good time to use Endure unless I have poison on the enemy or something, but... I'm gonna... Actually, you know what? I, I, just, I was gonna chant and just try to make it to the exit. Federal Repel, but what if a Wobble Pit pops up? That'd be horrible, and I forgot about that item. Oh boy. To Max Ether. Not that important. Maybe in the leaf floor. That's I that 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 uh, 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 uh. Forgot how to English. Uh, the only time I ever really use Ether is during the leaf floor and the champion of games. That's like the only time I ever use them. Oh, the Bell Sprout, and I did not switch out. Send Judith out. I was trying to rhyme, but that ended up being the same word. So that failed. Oh, come on. And Judith, I'm actually pretty impressed with her. She's way stronger than I thought she would be. Ghost does affect normal. Just use pack. I thought this is double slap, not triple slap. Oh gosh, follow me is such a useless move when you're doing single battles. And even double battles, it's not even that great. Switch out. I want to put Carl up first. Let's get him leveled up to 30. You have Pokemon. Let's start. No way. That's why I'm playing this game. Yeah. Uh, Ariana. All right. Let's water pulse. Rattata. Let's hope you only have 40 HP. Cool. Another one. You probably have less than 40 HP. Or at 40 HP. Less than or equal to. And probably you too. I don't imagine Bells were having. Oh, look at you. And you almost poisoned me. But you didn't, didn't you? Sucks to be you, and oh come on, we're one level away from, or one like one experience away from 29. What's this? It's a pearl. Maybe that was maybe at the time that was a hint to diamond and pearl. No, just kidding. You'd be able to find diamonds. They should have diamonds as Adam, but it's like super rare. I don't know. Maybe not. Dana. Dana. I'm gonna go Dana, because Dana just sounds like Dan with an A. Uh, I probably should use Water Pulse right here. Oh no, my attack fell. Critical hit of tackle. Giant dragon water snake thing just tackles you. Oh, look at that. Max HP is now 100. Cool. Oddish. Uh, 
Dragon Rage should probably handle that. Oh, I used Havel. Oh, come on. <laughs> Stupid misclick. That's what happens when you speed up, but I don't feel like spending 30 minute episode in here. I'd rather try to limit that down to like 20, 25. And Dragon Rage should finish you when I get the opportunity to use it. Never that may be. Plus you're using Sand Attack. Oh, come on. You know what? Let's just switch out to Glen. Or, you know, we might switch out to Lee. Awesome. I'm out of Pokemon. Yes, you are. Alright, let's... Oh, there's the exit. Yay! Cerulean CD Lavender Town. It's over here. There's nothing. There's probably a hidden item somewhere. Eh, yeah, whatever. Probably not important. Now I'm searching all these rocks. Yeah, I think we're good. And we're on Route 10! <laughs> not out of the... clear yet. I'm trying to remember if there's a grass route right here on Route 10 or not. Oh, I thought you were just a guy walking around. You tricked me. Keep bone, bone, bone. Alright, our paralyzed water snake dragon thing. Good, good. Bite it! Herman. Haha, <laughs> that's a cool name. Not really, it's actually kind of a lame name. Alright, here's Lavender Town. Let's not battle you. Oh, come on. I'm feeling a bit faint. I haven't hiked in some time. Actually, I'm thinking this actually might be a continuation of the past route we're on. Kind of like Viridian Forest. It's right, Route 2 is right before it, and then when you leave, you're back on Route 2. So. Oh, come on! Actually, that might have been beneficial. So at least getting a lot of experience that I don't really want him to have. Yet. I don't know. I guess it doesn't matter. You, however, you're dead. Oh. Her name was Carol. That's actually a potential nickname for a team member. Um. Actually, no, let's continue on. <laughs> this guy's just laughing. Clark. Should I have I wonder if that other hiker's name is Lewis? That would be actually kinda cool and funny. Super effective. Super effective. Come on. Now you missed. Though I should have probably switched out. I don't think you got a critical on me, that would have been bad. Onyx. Now he has a rock snake and we have a water snake. His isn't a dragon though, although it can learn dragon pulse. And I guess technically ours isn't a dragon either, so why not label Onyx as a dragon? And we got to level 30. I'm trying to learn Leer. Kind of tend to get rid of tackle for it, but then again, it's probably not worth it. Oh gosh dang it. No. Yes. Ha 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 ha, not laughing. Hey, hey, fever. Ha 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 ha, true. It's actually kind of funny. Kind of, not completely, just kind of. Alright. Let's put you up front. Put you up right there. And then let's finish up this episode with this guy. Ah, this mountain air is delicious. Can you taste there? I guess you can taste there. I don't see why not. I don't know how you label it as delicious or not. Use a water gun. One hit KO. Next up, Graveler. Oh, I guessed that perfectly. Haha. <laughs> I was gonna say, do you, dude? But I'm like, nah, this guy had an Onyx. He's serious. And almost 29. That cleared my head. I don't even remember what your original dollar was. Oh, you s delicious. Delicious error, yeah. Alright, so now we're in Lavender Town. I got 25 minutes, so I guess this is a good point to end this episode off. Healing. Dun, dun, da, da, da. 
there is another place I have ahead where I need cut. But I think it's optional. But next time we'll... Actually, there's another location past Celadon. And actually, to get in Celadon, you need cut. So, our dead Arwen. We haven't seen the last of her. Unless I find something else to use cut. These are the two Pokemon I caught off screen to fill up my Pokedex to I get Flash. But I'm releasing them because can't use them, that'd be illegal. Then the cops would be knocking on our door. And it's just bad overall, we don't want that happening. And put you back in the crypt, all our fallen Pokemon. That's it for today. Follow me on Twitter for updates on my channel.